In the first part of this two-part series, we reviewed tips on how to build a dynamic team. In the second part of this series, I'm going to present tips on how to retain a dynamic team. So here are those tips. Number one, respect your team, starting with all their wonderful qualities to all their shortcomings. Everyone wants respect, and once we have it, we never want to lose it, which means your staff will continue the behavior that generated that respect in the first place. Number two, develop a culture in which positivity and trustworthiness are the foundation, and then drench this culture by obsessively ingraining your values and your mission. We all want to be part of something, and we all want a common purpose for doing it. Your culture will take care of that. Number three, empower your staff to make decisions. And most importantly, stand by them when they do. Your staff will not always handle situations exactly as you would, and that's okay. If they handle a situation and do not obtain optimal results, take them into your office and do some coaching. Coaching requires asking questions so your employees themselves can evaluate the situation through their own thoughts, which encourages, them, which encourages them to think about how they could have handled the situation differently. And most importantly, coaching allows you to develop and grow your employees without having to talk down to them or, or give them the feeling that you're criticizing them. Number four, give incentives. Give rewards for performance. Use both individual and group rewards. This could be gift cards to individual employees for outstanding work and pizza parties for your staff for hitting key restaurant goals.